The Silver Cross G3 Handicap Hurdle, three mile. St. Orange up the top for Darren Thompson. Potter's Midnight, Napoleon Gray, five to one for pre-race favourite, Tower of London. Shipstern, Bluff, Trabago, Persian, Golf, Dolly, Forest Rock. And Stu Gray, number 10 for Hollywood Hinton. Racing. Yeah, they're quickly into it. And a poor jump from Potter's Midnight. Who now kicks forward. With Stu Gray. Past the winning post. Probably a couple of laps to go here. Take this outside track. And Potter's Midnight. Talking of Potter's, Graham Potter. The new manager of Brighton. Well, as he's either going to just tumble us straight out of the Premier League next season or we finish somewhere safe around 15 to 10. Hopefully it's the 15 to 10. And they go over the second flight, so it took them a fair while to get to that second flight. the third so Potter's Midnight clears the fourth from Stu Gray then we've got Dolly Tower of London and Persian Golf together on line of three and with another line of three behind them with Trabago, St. Orange and Shipstone Bluff and then we have Napoleon Grey and Forest Rock. So there's no pace as you would expect in the three mile hurdle. But the field is stringing out. Forest Rock looks to be struggling. But still a long way to go. 2,800 metres, 2,900 metres. So I can see Potter's Midnight's butt. And it jumps to seventh. And it's opened up its lead on Stu Gray and Dolly. Persian Golf. St. Orange. Shipstone Bluff. So running down to the winning post to signify a lap to go. Down on the fence, Tower of London hasn't worked at all. Trabago, Napoleon Grey, and Forest Rock at the tail. So Potter's Midnight still leads from Stu Gray, Dolly Dunn. This is a bit of a better view. Two away to Persian Golf, a mile to go. Then Shipstone Bluff, Tower of London, Trabago. We've got St. Orange, Napoleon Gray and Forest Rock who's tacking onto the field. So it's Potter's Midnight. About to be joined by Stu Gray. In fact, Stu Gray jumped into the lead there from Potter's Midnight. Dolly Handy third. Now moving with a strong run at the six furlong is Shipstern Bluff. Walking through it, Dolly. Also running on well from around the field is Tower of London. 
Persian Golf's up there. And getting pulled up now is Napoleon Gray. It's a bad luck Gray that's out of the race. And the last three are uh, Trabago, St. Orange and Forest Rock. As they run on towards the home turn here and up and over the 11th. And it's Stu Gray in front. Now Trabago takes over from Stu Gray. Shipstern Bluff, St. Orange into a handy position. Potter's Midnight, Dolly, Persian Golf, Tower of London, Forest Rock. So they race towards the second last flight. And it is Shipstern Bluff from Stu Gray, St. Orange, Dolly running on, up and over the second last. And getting pulled up is Forest Rock. Trabago's out the tail now after momentarily taking the lead, but a Shipstern Bluff in front over the last. Dolly out wider, kicking through again is Stu Gray, splitting him now, Persian Golf. It's Persian Golf, Tower of London. Persian Golf in front and is holding Tower of London and pulling away now, Persian Golf, and it wins from Tower of London, Potter's Midnight third. Changed a bit in the last furlong. But congratulations, Jim, with Persian Golf. Timely winner for you. Second Tower of London, Paul Rhodes. Potter's Midnight third for Ghost Zapper Stable. Dolly for Stu Gray was fourth. And fifth with Shipstern's Bluff for Molly at Surfer.